Welcome to the Rig and Farm YouTube channel. In this video, we'll be showing you our review of the Premier One Electric Poultry Netting and Solar IntelliShock 60 Energizer. Initial setup is straightforward with inserting the poles into the ground and creating a perimeter. Taking it down and moving it causes excessive tangling if you attempt it alone. Doing it with a helper can eliminate this problem. You can attach multiple fences together with the metal clips. With just one fence you can attach the two ends together, but it's not necessary to complete the circuit due to the design of the fence. Place the orange clip to one of the hot wires and the black clip on the grounding stake on the underside of the energizer. Push the button to make it live. Alternatively, you can create an access point by clamping the two ends together like this. Creating an opening to walk through is easy. Sagging is a problem even with the two spike poles. The fencing becomes low in spots and can sag on the ground, which will cause the fence to constantly shock the grass. We used what we had laying around to solve the problem. Twine was tied to the top of the fence, only touching wires that weren't live, and held taut with some logs on the other end. The fence stays up well, but the holes in the netting are big enough for our smaller chickens to easily jump through to escape. They were about 4 months old at the time of this video being made. It's easy to lure them back in with a bucket of feed, but this flaw defeats the purpose of using a fence to contain the chickens. Our dog learned very quickly that the fence is electrified and to avoid it, so at least it's effective in that aspect. We've had the fence set up for 6 weeks so far and haven't had any predator attacks. One major flaw that we've experienced is keeping the energizer charged. It has an optional electrical plug that can fully charge it indoors before taking it outside, but the solar panel has a hard time maintaining the charge unless it gets daily direct sunlight without obstructions from clouds or anything else. The Premier One poultry netting and solar energizer are okay for backyard use that you can monitor several times throughout the day, but it shouldn't be trusted to contain or protect your chickens if you're absent for more than a day or two. We'd love to hear if any of you have experience with this or similar system, as well as any tips to solve any of our unresolved problems. Comment below to share. Thanks for watching, and please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already.